inside Orchard Lakes Estates. We love our wildlife here. Neighbors say they're drawn here for the water, birds, and alligators. Um, almost every morning I see them. Erin Weaver has lived here six years without any concern for the reptile residents until this morning. Well, I saw him swimming and then I saw him turn, like, come swimming towards me and I saw something sticking out of his head. She took these pictures of what appears to be a kitchen knife lodged in an alligator's head. And it looked like a steak knife. I mean, that was sticking out of his head. Her photos and others have made the rounds on neighborhood social media groups drawing concern for how this happened. I feel that somebody did this on purpose. Never if I have seen them aggressive or even defensive. I mean, if you walk by, and you startle them, they just go underwater. And what to do next? Well, I want to get help for this alligator. I don't want to see an alligator swimming around with a knife in his head and suffering. Weaver says the serene beauty of this lakeside living is now tainted by the images she witnessed this morning and the thought of a neighbor harming this animal. And to get a knife in there, I mean, someone had to really, you know, thrown it hard or stabbed this poor thing hard. Weaver says Texas Parks and Wildlife was contacted and neighbors are expecting a game warden to check out the gator next Monday. We also spoke with the Brazos Bend State Park superintendent who tells us gators are very resilient and infection resistant. He's optimistic this gator is not in pain and could live like this for some time. In Fort Bend County, Shelley Childers, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.